Yo everybody, what's going on? Shane or Shanine here, back with another video for you. Um, so today we are diving under a huge bridge. It is in the heart of downtown. As you can hear, there's a lot of cars going above us. Um, it's super massive. Hopefully we find some awesome stuff, possibly guns, um, phones, wallets, anything that anybody threw over this bridge. Um, I'm gonna let you see it. It's uh, four lanes across and it goes straight onto the highway uh, 90 that's going all the way to Seattle. So hopefully there's some awesome stuff under there. But uh, yeah, let's, let's give you guys a look at it. Yes, I'm sorry, it's not a very good look under here, but right over there under this bridge, this massive bridge. Um, yeah, we're just gonna try, try to go down under there. The water doesn't look like it's moving too fast, so that's always good. All right, guys, so uh, I'm gonna get my gear on and then we are gonna go jump in the water and I'll see you guys in a few minutes. Peace. Oh, 
going on. We just hopped out of the water and I want to go through and show you all the amazing stuff we found because this is probably one of my best dives ever. We found so much cool stuff. Um, and yeah, I'm just gonna hop in and show you guys. My camera died for a lot of it. Um, well, probably like the last, uh, I don't know, last like five, 10 minutes I was diving and I found so many cool things. So we're gonna go through and show you all those things and plus everything else throughout the whole dive that I found. So uh, let's jump into it. All right, guys, so we're gonna start over here. It's like some kind of shopping cart, I think. Um, not too sure, honestly, but it is absolutely so cool. I found three shopping carts in total throughout my dive. Um, but yeah, this one is, this is the one I could get up. The other two were pretty buried, um, but yeah. I also found three bikes throughout the entire dive as well, and this is the only one I could get up. I did get a seat though off of the other one, one of the other ones, it was kind of just hanging there, so I took that. But uh, yeah, I found three bikes as well so that's freaking absurd and then as we were down here i think this is a bag of some sort i couldn't really tell but i took it out anyway because uh, it was kind of cool um and then we found this traffic cone as well as a traffic sign which honestly might be my ma my favorite find i love signs i'm definitely gonna keep it maybe even put it up in my house um that is absolutely awesome <laughs> and then we'll move into the electronic stuff we found so we found a whole screen slash TV I'm not exactly sure what it is uh, highly doubt it still works but freaking awesome um, and then we found <laughs> a CD player um, I think it's like a radio maybe but yeah I found that uh, <laughs> freaking Wii remote man I haven't seen one of these in so long but look at that it's a Wii remote crazy crazy um, we found this thing it's like a plug to something not really sure what it plugs into um, but super cool the end of it's broke off uh, we found this this was something that I found under there not really sure what it is looks something I don't even know to be honest with you guys <laughs> But then some more of the electronics. Um, we found a circuit board, which looks super clean on this side, but on the other side, and on the other side, it's not too bad either. Uh, a little bit dirty, but it's pretty crazy. A CD, another CD player. It's a Philips, is what it says on there. Um, it's a DVD video player, uh, which is so cool. I just found so many amazing things as a dive. Um, but yeah, just so you guys can see again, it's that one. <coughs> and then we'll move over here. We found a face mask and a pot absolutely absurd uh, some cologne I don't think that works anymore <laughs> and also a lighter that doesn't work I tried it out very sad because this lighter is super cool but um, yeah and then we found some binoculars some regular glasses not even sunglasses uh, a key to something possibly I'm not really sure what this is um, I'm not too sure what that is but it looks kind of cool. It was attached to something down there, so I cut it off and took it so we could see what it was. And then I found this watch, which is super old. Not really like a nicer watch, but it's kind of cool to find a watch. I don't find them very often. <coughs> and then we found two lawn chairs. Absolutely absurd. Two. Two. Two lawn chairs and a stroller, which has a hole right in the bottom of it. Just crazy stuff. Crazy, crazy stuff. And then, obviously, we have the trash that we found over there. Um, as you guys can see, this is a whole bag of trash that I tried to pull out. We put out that huge net that was under there so no fish or anything gets caught in it and dies. Don't want that to happen. But, yeah, I'll give you guys a huge overview, a little scan of all the stuff that I found. It's crazy. Crazy, crazy. It takes up half of this beach that I came up on. It's amazing. All right, guys, I'm going to end the video here. It was an amazing dive. Uh, we found so much cool stuff. I really hope you enjoyed watching me find it all and then seeing all of it on land, which is amazing. We found a bunch more stuff under there that I couldn't get up, sadly. I really did try to get all the carts and all the bikes up, but they're just trapped under too much stuff and too, uh, too decayed to get them up. But uh, I'm going to wrap it up here. I really appreciate you watching the video. Please like and subscribe, and I'm going to see you all in the next one. Peace. This could be us. So back to what I was saying